There go y'all daddy. I'm gonna record, make sure I record everything. Cause baby, we already gotta go to court and I'm not gonna play with him. Y'all, y'all, come on, come on. Let him know what y'all say. Y'all don't wanna go. Let him know, cause I'm not gonna force it. Let him know. I'm not gonna force y'all. Get this because I'm gonna need this for corn I need this to play y'all. Y'all can give him a hug. Give him a hug. Oh, y'all ain't got money like that. Give him a hug. Come on, I'm so nice. I got a spoonful. Get that tag in my all in the honey. But I got it at the house too. Why? Yeah, I mean, this is my day to come. Come on, let's go. She be being me. I don't know what she be doing. I ain't got nothing to do with it. Come on now. You just still want. No, I don't still want him. You just him. still want him. I don't him. still like, want listen, him, baby. We are in a I don't relationship still want him. now. We are in you a relationship line now. now. You wrong for that. You, I don't want you him. You do want him. I don't want him. Like they don't want to go because they you're being mean. Go. They say you're being mean to them. Kids, y'all so know I don't be being mean to y'all. Just because I have some discipline in my home don't mean that I be being mean. I supposed to have rules. Rules are for children. Yes, and you, you gotta understand. You gotta respect the house, and you probably putting them to do that. Yes. No, I ain't putting them to do nothing. I know how you, you do it. I know you how still you do want him. Oh, girl, you, you, you bitch. Please. I don't really know if this is my last time, but what I know is I'm feeling just fine. My life is like a red carpet, and I'm feeling like the richest millionaire. This is my local man, and I'm the biggest star around here. We got to talk about it. What's happening, fam? LAR movement still moving. Subscribe or die trying. Shout out to Minister Jap. You see all his name on the thing. That's where I got it from, right? So here's the thing. Um, There comes a point where this, this bad behavior that's taught, now you don't want to, this is how it, it happens. See, those kids are small. But I don't want to go with you. I don't want to go. I don't do that. And all I needed to see was that the look on her face when they said, you know, she got rules. And you're like, grown people supposed to, you know, rules are for kids. And the mother just sitting there like, well, uh, well, they don't like y'all. It's like, oh, here we go. So <sighs> later on in the video, you know, because I'm not going to play the whole thing because it's almost five minutes long. He was like, do I hit y'all? The lady said, do I hit y'all? I was like, no, she don't hit us. She just she just me. I was like, yeah, y'all don't abide by rules and y'all get checked. And here's the issue. Mom don't abide by rules either. Because while this whole thing is going on, it's dad's day to pick him up. Is mom abiding by the rules? No. No. And, but she uses the kids to not abide by the rules, right? So I'm going to feed them this information. I'm going to act like I'm protecting them, but I'm being petty, right? And what happens normally when those kids get older, they're petty like that. See, a lot of times um, these strain, like people aren't abandoned like people say back in the day. You know, they didn't get abandoned or somebody left them or nothing like that. What happened was they were maybe a little younger than that age, around that age, and, and, and up to teenage years. That's how they were acting. I don't want to go. Mama said I ain't got to go. I don't want to talk to you. Mama said I ain't got to talk to you. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. And, and and that becomes such a normal routine. It drives a wedge between parent and child or parent and children. And the kids don't remember anything because, you know, see, these, these kids might have to see this when they're 16, 18, 20, 25 to go. I did do that. Because when you're a kid and this, this stuff is not on video, you don't remember all the, all the games that you were playing along the way. And people will say, but I was a child. And it's like, yeah, I get it. You was a child. You was a child at 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, you know, 18 years old, right? So from, I'm going to just go from 6 to 18, 12 years, you might have been acting out of pocket 8, 9, 10 of your, those years. 
So it's like, now that you grown, man, gone. No, 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 we good. And it's like, no, I got abandoned. No, 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 no. You got played. And what happens is, like, the thing about the mothers in this situation is, A lot of y'all don't want to hear what I'm about to say, but it has to be said. A lot of y'all waste y'all adult lives being a bitter baby mama. And at the end of the day, you got nothing to show for it. But, a, but a, your, 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 your gift is a broken relationship between the child and their father. That, that, that's what all this, is, this was for. And, and nine times out of ten, you're going to have a broken relationship with your child. You know, either either they they rock with you or, or or they're stuck to you, and you don't you don't want them to be stuck to you because you didn't had them clinging to you because you wanted to be 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 bitter and petty, and now they they so they still clinging to you, and you want freedom, and it's too late. You can't get it now. Now they grown, always hovering around you, and you thought it was gonna be cool, but it's not. Because <clears throat> that's not a like. Unfortunately, I gotta say this. That's not a genuine. Uh, loving relationship between parent and child, you know, <clears throat> that that's quote unquote toxic. The other thing, you know, <coughs> the lady was tripping like, you know, oh, he was trying to holler at me last week. Put a pause in that because I was late on in the video. I got to say it could be a skit, could not be, but it's a normal thing. But if you watch a little bit of that clip, read that woman's shirt. Not to, not to day MF and Satan. You know, not to MF and day Satan, basically. You know, and it's like, see, sometimes the kids don't catch that, but the adults do. But the adults ignore it, and it's like, you need to get a life. You know, I'm gonna go in the closet and I'm gonna get my not today Satan shirt because I, cause I, I don't need these problems. And it's like, nah, seem like Satan won with you. Seem like it is the day and you are Satan. So, what are we talking about here? Now, getting back to the, you know, the idea of she. You know, he doesn't want her anymore, but she's still mad that he left her. He cheated on her, like she said later on in the video. It's like, he he just called. He was texting me. And it's like, uh, and he was reaching for the phone. Like, no, nah, we ain't finna do that. Because they, the guy was like, look, we was together. Him and his woman was together last week. The last week they were talking about. So she knew what he was doing. He knew what she was doing. And he's like, so, so she went from he was texting me. To know he was like we was together last week. Well, he was texting me on a ghost phone on a different number. It's like, oh, okay. So I got the number. Look, I know it was him, though. You know it was him. So you went from he was texting you, which meant he was called texting you from his phone to them saying, "Ain't no way." To them going, oh, it was a, it was a made up. It's a Mission Impossible phone. You know he was trying to get at me on the low. All right, man. I got it in my phone, so you got so you just got random text messages, but you know it's him. And some of y'all do stuff like that, like y'all, like I hate to say this, but some of y'all have played that game with y'all child using the phone, where oh your, your daddy said this, or they text me this, and it ain't and it ain't the dad. You get what I'm saying? It's just something, it's just some some random message that somebody, you know, they sent somebody and they covered it up. And, Send me this message real quick. And like, see, look, you see that? That's what he said. It's like, kid ain't going to think about it because some of these kids don't talk to their dad. On, they don't even know their dad's number. You get what I'm saying? They just get the phone when mama give them the phone. <laughs> so, or, or, you know, so it's one of those things like all the lying and the manipulation goes on. And when I started in the beginning with how this ends is, this is how those kids are going to be. 
Like this is what you, when you teach this, and you're and you're ten toes down for that. That's what you're gonna teach the kids to do. So they're gonna be you know petty, manipulative, bitter. But the problem is, they're like you wanna you can you wanna claim that you're the victim. That's not they're not gonna be victims. Just like you're not a victim. They they're gonna be you know line steppers, habitual line steppers. Shout out to the habitual line steppers. But that's what they're gonna be. You know, so I'm going to leave it at that because that's bad parenting. That's just what it is. But tell me what you think. Like, share, subscribe, or die trying. Catch y'all on the next one. Peace. All I ask is when you lay your head on that pill at night, you know I gave you everything I had.